We're here at NAM 2020 on the Minel booth with Norbert. So he's going to talk us through everything new for 2020. So what have you got for us, Norbert? That's right. So let's take a look inside where I can show you what's new for 2020 here from Minel. Follow along. So here we are in our booth at NAM 2020. And this is what we have going for this year. Let me start off by showing you these new symbols. They're called our Pure Alloy Custom line of symbols. What those are essentially is our pure alloy symbols from previous years, but a lot of people ask us about medium or lighter weights in this series. And this is essentially what those are. These are pure alloy symbols in lighter weight and medium, medium weight, medium weight, and with a smoke bronze finish on top and a brilliant finish on the bottom. What we have is a 22 inch ride 16, 18 and 20 inch crashes, a 15 inch pair of heads and an 18 inch trash crash. Let me play them for you so you can hear how they sound like. I'll start off with the right. Pure Alloy Custom, new for 2020, available already all over the world. In our Bison's range, we are introducing more dual symbols. As you know, our dual symbols have been categorized in our Extra Dry series, and we took them out from Extra Dry and gave them their own category, now Bison's Dual. And every symbol you see here is an additional model in the dual series. Besides all the existing models that we have had for many years, these are all new Bison's Dual models. A lot of people have asked us about trash crashes in Bison's Dual, which we are introducing 16, 18, 20 inch trash crash and also 14 inch, we call that multi-trash. It can be used in various ways, first as a standard trash splash, 14 inch. But the cool thing about it is you can also stack it, for example, use it as a hi-hat top or as a triple top on top of a normal top, so you have a triple hi-hat. Or you can simply stack it on any other symbol that you like. 14-inch multi-trash, 16, 18, 20 trash crashes. Also, a lot of people asked us about chinas in the Bison stool range, which are here, 16, 18, 20 inch, China. And a pair of 14 inch heads, because so far there has only been a pair of 15 inch heads, and now we have a pair of 14 heads as well. And last but not least, we have a 19 inch crash in the dual range as additional size and additional sound option in this range of symbols. One more thing to mention are these two new models in our pure alloy range, which is a 12 inch trash china. Maybe some of you remember, we used to have this model in another series that we discontinued a couple years ago. A lot of people asked us to bring this one back or whether or not we still have it on stock somewhere so they can buy it from us. We brought it back, a 12-inch trash splash in the pure alloy range and a 24-inch medium ride in the pure alloy range from Minel Symbols. It's interesting that, the, that these symbols with, you know, the trash symbols with the holes in make up sort of at least, well, about half of your display. Um, so you've obviously found that they continue to sell well. Yes, because the music needs it, drummers need it, they need that sound. Like you were saying earlier, you love the fact that they're so fast and the, the attack is so strong. Just imagine in today's music, a lot of those drummers, they just use them to keep time. They need a strong accent to keep time. But if they use a normal crash, the sustain is forever. And then there is no clear message to the other musicians. It's one big, one big roar if they keep time on a crash. These don't have that. They, there's a very clear impact, a very clear info in reference to the time. And that's why today's music and today's drummers kind of appreciate those instruments for the music they're playing. Definitely. Well, these sound absolutely stunning. I really like the, um, the say it's smoked, smoked bronze. Smoked bronze. 
on top and brilliant finish on the bottom. And then, and that has obviously no effect on the tone. That's right. The, the finish has no effect on the tone. It is simply for looks. Yeah. The tone comes from the thinner weights, lighter weights. Sure. And from obviously hammering patterns, lacing, all of that. What's also important to know about these is that the time that goes into these to make these is the most um, how should I say, it takes the longest, the most production steps go into these symbols compared from all other lines that we have. So they take longer they take to make. They take the longest time of all, the most production steps, the most amount of work that goes into these symbols from all the lines that we have. To get this finish, to get the brilliant finish, the hammering, the lathing, and then there is a scraping to get some of the finish off again. So it's separate to, to lathing? Se yes, yes, separate to lathing. There is a lot of production steps going into these symbols. That's also why they are slightly more expensive compared to the standard pure alloy. Because there is a lot of additional work that goes into this series. Perfect. Well, thanks so much for talking us through Anytime. everything. Excellent. Have a good show. You too.